What's up everyone, it's my yard here. Time for some WWE news of an interesting nature. I know I'm not talking about Roman Reigns being this suspended, but it is a tiny bit about Roman Reigns. Now, WWE is coming back to Scotland, okay? Big thing that's happening in Glasgow Monday night, live, raw. Well, for the UK it would technically be, be live America to get it at an unusual time, but live for us. The key thing is, though, on the same day in my hometown of Aberdeen, Scotland, they have a house show. And in that house show, they've said, confirmed, is The New Day, Bray Wyatt, AJ Styles, and Roman Reigns. They have been apparently confirmed to appear at the house show. Now, that begs two questions. One... This was announced um, on the WWE.com's website. You can have a look yourself. Type in WWE Aberdeen on there, uh, WWE.com. You will find the listing. You'll see all the superstars, including Naomi and Becky Lynch. And secondly, they announced this after the draft. After the draft had hap um, announcement that they were going to do the draft. So that means they've already got an inkling of who is going on to what roster. I think, obviously, they would people would want New Day still stuck together and goodness like that. It's good for me because it means I can kick Xavier Woods as Ash, Mr. Austin Creed's Ash at WWE 2K16 or 2K17 would be at at that point. So yeah, he kick his ass on that. No, it's no two qualms about it. Yeah, he, his ass would be handed to him on a silver platter. It's great that WWE is coming back to Aberdeen. It's been six long, long years. Um, we've not heard anything about it. Maybe I had an influence. I, I remember several months ago I was asking why hasn't WWE came back to, to the hometown because it sold out two nights in a row at one point. Hardly any house shows do that. And yet completely ignored and focused more on Glasgow. And Glasgow, don't get me wrong, is the bigger city. Uh, has a much bigger arena. The, the Aberdeen Expedition Centre only can hold about 2,500, 3,000 people at a push. The Hydro is going to be able to hold 12. That's quite a bit, 10 to 12,000. It's a big, big gap. So my question to you guys is draft related. And it's all about who do you think will be on Raw or SmackDown? It would make sense for AJ to be on SmackDown. And if you go with the general consensus of the better matches appear on SmackDown, if you go from the previous draft extension, draft split and all of that nature. And same for the New Day. Roman, nearly the big guy, he's kind of like the Batista. <laughs> and Bray is kind of like the Undertaker. There's a lot of similarities you can compare. They might still change the roster, we just don't know. But that's the general thought process I've got in the back of my mind. Leave your thoughts in the comment section below, guys. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more WWE gaming goodness and for WWE news. And we'll see you very soon. And yes, Roman got suspended. We all know. What a shock.